Hello YouTube, bad advice, popular sunburn hacks that should not be repeated. Bronze tan is always in fashion, but if you overheat a little in the sun, instead of a golden hue, the skin takes on the color of boiled cancer. In addition to being unesthetic, burns hurt, itch, and prevent sleep. You can find many life hacks on social networks on how to deal with the unpleasant symptoms of sunburn, but experts warn that most of them are ineffective and even dangerous. We have compiled the most common sunburn treatment tips that should not be put into practice. The most effective way to avoid unpleasant consequences after prolonged exposure to the sun is the right protection. When walking in direct sunlight, always wear a hat and use sunscreen. But if you are still burned, you need to soothe irritated skin. Sunburns can be quite painful and are accompanied by blisters, swelling, headache, nausea, and fatigue. In addition, burns increase the risk of developing melanoma, which in 90% of cases occurs under the influence of the sun and ultraviolet radiation. There are dozens of ways on social media to alleviate the unpleasant effects of burns but experts warn that many of them can only exacerbate the situation. Here are the most dangerous sunburn hacks you should never try on yourself. Mouthwash Some TikTok users are convinced that mouthwash is effective in relieving pain after sunburn. Dermatologists say that although menthol and eucalyptus, which are part of the rinse, have a cooling effect, in addition to them, the solutions contain alcohol and benzoic acid which will irritate the skin even more. Sour Cream One of the most well-known ways to treat sunburn at home is to smear with sour cream. Lactic acid really promotes the regeneration of skin cells, but there are products that are much more effective. Among them are aloe vera, coconut oil, soy-based moisturizers, and drinking plenty of water. Vinegar some social media users recommend using vinegar to relieve the pain of sunburn. Never follow this advice. Vinegar has a very high acidity. If you apply it to the skin, it will destroy the protective barrier and lead to increased pain and inflammation. In addition to sunburn, you risk earning chemical ones. Contouring with sunscreen. Fashion to use sunscreen as makeup is a bad idea. Bloggers advise applying the cream not to the entire face, but selectively, leaving cheeks and forehead for tanning. With such contouring, you can achieve a short-term effect, but experiments can result in skin damage, premature aging, and even cancer. In summer, apply a sunscreen of at least SPF 50 daily to the entire face. Safe Exposure to the Sun People have different skin types but everyone should use sunscreen. Fair-skinned people are more susceptible to skin damage from UV rays. Therefore, they are at a higher risk of getting cancer when exposed to the sun. However, dark-skinned and dark-skinned people are also susceptible to the harmful effects of sunlight. Their skin contains more melanin, which causes a tanning effect and partially blocks the effects of ultraviolet radiation, but only to a certain extent. Therefore, owners of darker skin need to use sunscreen. Thank you for your time and attention listening to me. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. You can also click the bell sign to be informed about new videos. Have a great day.